The government says weak sentiment in the property market will not affect its land supply program. Three more residential plots are to go on sale to provide more private flats. Macy Mok reports. Three residential sites in Kai Tak, Stanley and Kennedy Town will be put up for tender between October and December. They are expected to provide a total of 2,500 flats. The MTR's Oyster Bay property development and the Urban Renewal Authority's project in Saiyang Pun are expected to provide around 1,600 flats. Together with two other development projects that will complete lease modifications, the total supply of flats is expected to reach 5,900 in the third quarter. Taken together with the 6,000 flats from the first two quarters, the total from April to December is expected to be 11,900, over 90 percent of the annual private housing supply target. Development Secretary Bernadette Lin admits there is pressure to reach the land revenue forecast of $120 billion. Our objective is to increase land supply in a stable and steady manner, and we do our proper valuation. So, if if indeed the land sale revenue is a bit below our target, this is a reality that we have to accept. But what is important is that we do proper market valuations. Lin added that property sector sentiment is relatively weak, but the government will not slow down its land supply program. Maisie Mock, HKIBC.